five, six, seven, and <laughs> it's helping keep warm. because we just found out we booked the wrong dates for our hotel. So now we're scrambling and looking for a new hotel because everyone seems to be in Amsterdam now. It's high season, so everything is sold out. Hopefully, we will not sleep on the streets. Fingers crossed. So we're finally in our hotel. Chris still feels very, very bad, but everyone's okay because we're now all settled in and ready to explore Amsterdam and forget about the unexpected start. Designated leader of this trip now is Nana. Elid mo kami, please don't fail us like how you failed us in Berlin. Who told you I failed you in Berlin? Me, I was there. Look at all these cute streets here. Super cute streets, right? Yeah. Are you feeling better? I'm feeling better. Yes, she is. We're looking for a nice place to eat because we're all so hungry. That is true. Just a car Oh no, no. Run! Don't die for the vlog! Endless canals of Amsterdam. I really hope that the entire time we're here, I don't get hit by a bike from all the vlogging that I'm trying to do. How many minutes, ma'am? Like a minute. A minute? How many meters is that? Like, um, one. <laughs> Maybe seven. Seven meters. Got it. Thank you so much, Waze. <laughs> yes, waffle. All for me. So we were walking towards a restaurant because we wanted to get dinner. But then we heard the music from this and it looks like there's a street party. And so our plans have changed. Street party! Okay. So now I found out what this party is all about. Apparently it's a community party. So I can't really repeat what the community party is. It's for real big or something like that. So basically they do this party where everyone in the neighborhood pitches in like bars, cafes, shops. And it goes on from 12 noon until 10 p.m. It looks so fun! For you, you have to go out. Uh, They're calling for the queen, me. Queen Nana. Ready to go out. The food is calling. <laughs> it's our first full day here in Amsterdam. Unfortunately, it's super duper gloomy right now. Well, it's not raining hard, it's drizzly, but it's been raining the entire morning, which is why we changed our plans from going around and touring the sites of Amsterdam to just chilling in cafes and looking for good food and looking for cute little spots where we could just hang out and do. Nothing. So I'll keep you guys updated. It's arriving first. My meal. People in Europe know that this face is the pinaka bottom face. Looks so good, right? Laura's order. <laughs> is this order? Nana's order. Nah, Nana doesn't care. Oh, this is awesome! Sharing is caring! So after lunch comes to shopping. We're now at the De Nine Drakjes. It's full of a lot of like little charming stores, not the super duper big brands. 
which means they're not as scary as well. <laughs> we found this vintage store. It's apparently a really, really cool store. They sell a lot of vintage finds. really cute things for my home. I'll show it to you guys next time, but I got a bunch of clocks and I gift free Yanni and I got a gift wrap. So cute. <gasps> Guess what? We're gonna eat again. This is the laziest trio trip ever, but the funnest. But it's also because I'm already 30, she's 29, she's 28, so it also came with age. She's even stretching off. <laughs> <laughs> Don't lie to me. Don't be a liar. Finally got my drink. Everyone got their drink. Time to cheers. No one wants to cheers with me. Cheers. Mm. So fresh. Mm. Nana wins most special drink ever. Look at that berry. It's so cute. It's very nice. Very, very nice. Truffle fries. More and more fries. I've been stuffing my face with so many fries this entire trip. So going to dinner without this one. Bye, Lorene. Bye. We're still here because without Lorin, no one can decide for us. We don't know where to eat. Where do we go from here, my love? I think we should go to W. We'll go to W. Come now, come. She's alive. Take my hand. So quick change before we go off to dinner. I want it to be in something more comfortable and with more fabric since it's getting colder and colder as the sun sets. We're on our way to W Hotel. We're gonna check out Mr. Porter. But the real reason why we chose to go to Mr. Porter is because we heard that the after dinner drinks at W Hotel is really really good. And you know us titas, we like our drinks! Guys, hello from the other side. That's it. Abort, abort. We are not able to enter Mr. Porter wow. because we didn't have any reservations. We didn't think it would be so full because it's a Monday night. Looks like a good place to chill out though. And now, off to the Duchess. We still have an hour for our table to free up, so what do we do? We drink! It's a really, really good cocktail. If you guys want cocktails, come to the Duchess. They make really good ones. Finally, food! We're pretty healthy right now. This is the quinoa salad and crunchy zucchini with truffles. My request. Guys, how do we keep warm? Five, six, seven, and... <sighs> <laughs> this is how we keep warm. Good morning. Today seems like better weather, but it's still kind of cloudy. Hopefully tomorrow it's gonna be sunny. But today, we're going to this beautiful lunch place called The Cat. So it's something that Nana searched for, and apparently it's one of the most famous restaurants here. So we really, really want to try it. We even booked a reservation just to make sure that we won't be turned away. We're more responsible tourists now. Apparently this restaurant is a farm to table restaurant and because we're very tita already, these are the type of restaurants that we like. Those you know my healthy, organic type of restaurants. I'm really excited. I can't imagine old Camille ever, 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 ever appreciating this because old Camille really like super duper fried and fatty food. But now I appreciate really good food, especially vegan food. We're here, we're back in the Philippines. <laughs> Just kidding. We're already here walking to the cast. So it's really out of the way. It's not a very touristy area. Not a lot of people go here. It looks like we got transported to the countryside. Look! Ta-da! So this container actually contains biscuits and homemade bread. And then we have these oh. as well. I don't know what they are. It looks like Rice Krispies though. Oh, this is tapioca. <laughs> Favorite zucchini, and we have another from the house turnip. We're supposed to eat this by hand. <laughs> so good. Mm. The powder is so good. I feel like a rabbit though. 
What's up, dog? This is the first out of our three-course meal, which is this one. And this is our potato salad. Prettiest potato salad ever. It's so good. Oh, it's so good. Um, it's a bit, uh, when you when you put it inside your mouth, it's kind of... <laughs> Uh, the graininess, the texture. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so for our second course is roasted young leek. I need to learn how to cook like this. Flowers for me. Looks so good. So it's roasted eggplant with all the herbs that's currently blooming in their garden. And a very very thin rice crispy or something like that. Thank you so much for taking my photo. Napaka graceful mo. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Emoji. <laughs> To the Reject Museum! Yeah! <laughs> I don't want You don't want to get rejected. Okay. But we're going to the Reject Museum, so we're gonna get rejected. Or Reject Museum, because I am. Sorry. I know. Hi, Reject Museum. Hi, Reject Museum. Hi, Reject Museum. <laughs> it is the perfect spot for that. Well, we're now on the way to Moko Museum where there are two hearts over there for the Banksy exhibit because we're trying to at least be productive today and not just go and eat and sleep and I would eat still and wanna, coffee like, and drink coffee. Of course it's there but just so there's a little bit of variety in our <laughs> vlog and I. <laughs> we need to be proactive with our lives, guys. We print this one million words of these Princess D notes. This is Diana. So clever. So I just finished going around the Banksy exhibit and I don't know why but I feel kinda I was very affected by his work. It's very relevant to what's happening now and he voices out his opinions on the government, politics, capitalism. I think all these pieces, although they look very modern, they really make you think and that's why I feel so heavy after looking at all the graffiti. They're not just pretty to look at. They force you to actually think about what his art really means and what he's trying to Day. I liked it. Which is why I also bought something. I bought the iconic girl with a balloon print on a shirt. I really like it. Where are we walking to? Walk to walk. Because we like to walk. Walk. No. <laughs> walk. We're gonna go to walk to walk just because we're Asian. That's really the main reason why. I love it. It's really good. Don't know about you, but I love it. Because we have farm to table kami kanina, so we feel extra healthy, which is why we want some carbs. <laughs> Yun lang yun. We need carbs. Carbs, 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 carbs. Ta da! Walk to walk is here. So basically, you get to choose your noodles, your toppings, and your sauce. So we decided to get whole wheat noodles, chicken breast, shiitake mushroom, tofu, and fried garlic with garlic and black pepper sauce. Chris and I are ready, and the other duo is not ready again. <laughs> and to think, kami pa ni Chris ang smoky eyes. Do you know what the smoky is called? Red. No, it's called natural. <laughs> it's called star ice. <laughs> On the way to Food Helen. Hopefully, this is the correct one. We're just following people. You just smell where the food is. So again, I am the designated leader of the group, leading them to where the food and drinks are. And in tonic bar, straight to my heart, yeah. This is the cutest thing ever. Oh, so cute! So we found this gin and tonic bar, and we each ordered different types of gin. I got the Mombasa strawberry, which is basically gin with strawberries and mint. Chris got gin marrow, which is lemon thyme, basil, lemon zest. Lorene got sip mint, which is with lime, ginger, and mint. So they're all sound really, really good. And we're all very, very thirsty. We're very thirsty to eat us, right? Here's your order, ma'am. Thank you. Here's my order, ma'am. I thought she was a waitress. She came up from behind me and said, Hey man, can I take your order? I was like, oh no, wait, wait. Because I'm very European. She looks very 
Cheers! Jen is in. To feast. I'm jealous of Prizzy's order. It's good. <laughs> here in Amsterdam. We originally planned to have brunch at the avocado show. It's currently already 1 p.m. So the brunch is no longer a brunch. It's officially a late lunch because tequila happened last night. So some of us, <coughs> not me, some of us were struggling in the morning. But now everyone's alive and kicking and we're just a few steps away from the avocado show. I'm really so excited because I googled it and they had a lot of really good meals there. Like all centered around avocado. So, apparently there is a line and it also says card payments only. No cash, no gold, no diamonds. We just got our names listed because there's a long line. It's around an hour so we're gonna hit a cafe first so that we'll survive. And then off to the avocado shop in my very Madame floral <laughs> Madame outfit. If you guys watched my Finland vlog, this is actually one of the fabrics that I bought from Marimesco. And it took me this long to design something for it. If we didn't make a mistake in our booking, we're actually living in this neighborhood. So according to my boyfriend's friend, this is the hipster area. That's why there's also a lot of cafes, vintage stores, and a lot of hip looking peeps. Chris, I don't think you like Chanel, no? I'm not so sure. <laughs> Very subtle, very subtle. I'm not sure yet. Andy Dex for other bags. Finally seated, and this is the menu for lunch. Everything has avocado. I think I'm gonna get this one. And this one. Mm. And my apple poke bowl is here. It's the prettiest poke bowl ever. And my smoothie. I like to love you. Coming back, I did this Heineken experience before when I went here. When I was on vacation during my student exchange program, and it was so much fun. And we have the blow up and market, and there's so many pretty blooms here. Look at how they decorated the city. Look at all these tulips. Oh, oh I think I want to buy flowers for myself. Look at this funky building. We're currently at Flex Beach Bar. When in Europe, service is is not so slow. It's just they like to take their time. They don't want you to be all like. They want you to appreciate the silence. Like, We've been waiting fifteen minutes. Also, we're not really sure if you can do this to them and like call their attention. So all we do is do this. We stare at the waitress. Are you coming there? Not there. Ready? Hola, hola, we want to order a wine bottle because it is our last night here in Amsterdam. <laughs> so we deserve to celebrate, right? Yeah. It's freezing. So we also need warm. Via the wine. Wine. They both start with it. W. Oh, tali tali no all these places that most of the locals visit and just really just eat and sleep and walk around and shop but yeah it was a really really good trip with the girls i wish that we could do another trip really really soon if you guys love this vlog please make sure to subscribe to my channel and let me know what you guys think on the comment section below give me a thumbs up cheers and goodbye